In this video, I will show you how to add the amazing motion graphics for like, subscribe and bell notification on your videos in Premiere Pro. Coming up. Hi everyone, I'm Harshwadhan. Welcome to HarshwadhanArt.com. In this special video, I will show you how you can easily add the like, subscribe and notification bell icon on your videos in Premiere Pro. And if you are a YouTuber, then it's very important that you remind your viewers to like, subscribe and press the bell notification. That way you can increase your subscribers and boost your engagement. Earlier, I used to create my own like, subscribe and bell notification animations in Premiere Pro, but you know that creating the animations or the cool motion graphics is really a pain in the back in Premiere Pro. Then I found out this YouTube pack from the media stock on VideoHive.net and I really love this pack because it has all the variations of YouTube like, subscribe and press the bell notification icon. It has lots of cool and modern motion graphics animations and all these are very easy to use. All you have to do just drag and drop over your video clip and you are good to go and the good thing about this motion graphics pack from the media stock is that it supports 4k resolution so that means you don't have to worry even if you are working on a 4k project you can easily add these motion graphics to your 4k videos as well these motion graphics are very easy and simple to use all you have to do just drag over your clips resize if required and reposition it and it has lots of different variations and each and every variations of youtube like subscribe and bell notification they all are fully customizable you can customize their color their size their font so you can just literally do anything with the help of this one let's see how you can use these and download it and for that purpose we need to go to the pc screen and if you want to download this the link of this is in the description section below after downloading you get this kind of a folder this is a zip folder just extract it and you will get this folder inside this folder there is a video tutorial and there is a subscribe pack that is moget files so all of these are the motion graphics pack and if you open this text link there are some font links just copy them and paste in your browser and download these fonts these are two fonts so you need to download these then the second one copy that one and download the second one as well and after downloading just extract them these are also the zip files right click and select extract and then select all of these phone files and right click and select install for all users and doing this install both the font families which are used in this otherwise you will get the font error or missing font error and then after go to the premiere pro go to the essential graphics right click on the top menu and select manage additional folder and select add and then select the moget files of the youtube subscriber which we have downloaded and press ok and over here you will see all of these moget files or these motion graphics related to the youtube so these are all these graphics you can see so these are some, some of the packs let me make them a little larger so that you can see it properly so these are the files and you can click on the star to make them as your favorite so that you can easily access them or easily browse them and apply on your videos and then press the parenthesis key go back and select on this star icon and that would show all of your favorite motion graphics and when we'll scroll down you will see all of those youtube subscriber packs or those motion graphics which are included in the motion graphics just expand it if you don't find it this and just scroll it down and you can see all of these are over here and now you need to just click and drag it over your video clip where you want to apply them it is going to take some time and once it is applied you can just press the space or just move your play hat over the motion graphic and you will see this is 
it's way too big according to our clip let's go down to scale and scale it down as per your liking by clicking on the motion and by clicking and dragging to reposition it wherever you want and just press the space to see how it looks So isn't this amazing it's very easy to use and these motion graphics are really amazing so let's find another one and let's try to apply that so let's go for this one just click and drag it over here and just move your playhead over the clip and let's scale it down something like this go to the the motion first and drag it on the bottom of the screen i like it over here and when you will play you can see i can change my channel name and other information so for this purpose we'll go to the edit in the essential graphics and click on the text one setting and type your channel name over here so i'm typing my channel name harshwardhan art all right you can even change the fonts and everything else if you want to and let me just make them capital okay and i can resize this as you can see this is way too large so by clicking on this over here this slider i can resize them okay this one it looks good and then come down a little bit you can even change the font if you want by clicking on this you can change the font type bold or all caps and everything so all these settings are available so these are very fully customizable you can uh, customize them according to your liking and these text to settings go to the text to settings and write your topics of your video channel so i'm just writing video editing photography and photo editing something like this so whatever is your tagline you can just type that as well over here you can see this is now appearing over here and you can again change the color of the text you can change the fonts as well then the text tree so there is a text tree that is subscribe if you want to change it to something else you can do that as well and then we have the text 4 text 5 so everything is customizable over here so you can customize them according to your liking or your personal preference you can even change the colors of different assets used in this graphics and now let me show you how to add the picture as you can see over here your channel art is not appearing over here on the this round circle so let me just find one picture of your channel art i'm just taking this picture and import this and draw it under this motion graphics and let's resize it and reposition it and click on this and scale it down and select on the motion and move it behind this circle and resize it again maybe something like this reposition it so that it fits around the circle and then if you press the play button it's going to show you but the problem is this that it starts way too early so we need to just resize them to start only when this circle appears okay and you can even reposition it i suggest it even further and just drag it from the hand side as well so let's make it something like this and let's play it once again yes this one is looking much better and let's find another one you can see there are so many different variations of like subscribe and bell notification icons let's try this one drop it over here and press the space button to play it and you can see it's way too large because it's supposed 4k resolution let's scale it down to something like this and now let's select the motion and drag it at the appropriate position and let's Play it. You can see wow. Subscribe and subscribe, and then it shows the bell icon. Click on the bell icon. Let's find something else. Let's go this one. Drag it over here. Press the space button. You can see we're too large. Let's scale it down. We can even scale it from the master transform. And we can even adjust the position but more by clicking on the motion it's very easy and simple let's place it over here on the right side and let's play and see the preview wow 
what a cool animation so you don't have to do anything let's find another one let's try let's say this one click and let's place it over here and now let's press the play button and you can see it is also very large so let's make it smaller by clicking on the master transform and scale it down something like this click on the motion and reposition it wherever you want and then press the space button to play to see the preview all right i think we need to adjust this position so let's go to the motion and drag it little left and now it looks good wow so this is an amazing amazing pack you must download this the link of this is in the description section below so thank you so much i hope you found this youtube pack useful if you want to download it the link of this is in the description section below go ahead download it and use it and you can easily boost your subscribers and viewers engagement so i hope you found value in this video if you found any value please hit the like button if you have any question or if you want to say something leave that in the comment section below and if you are not subscribed to this channel please consider subscribing and to subscribe just click the big red button below this video and don't forget to press the bell icon that way you will not miss any video from this channel so thank you so much bye bye see you in the next video till then keep shooting and unleash the creative in you bye bye